Hi friends, it's Rishi and I'm here with our next origami lesson where here is our little sheet that we have and sorry if it looks like there's a weird angle. Um, today we're going to be doing a bird and I know that's really vague but it's kind of like a pigeon bird. So I have this really pretty blue today and um, once again, make sure that you know where it's your front and back side are. Mine is white. Yours might be the same color, which is completely fine. And I'm going to start off by holding it like a diamond rather than a square. And then I'm going to take this, um, this point and then bring it all the way to this point. So in half. Holding it right in half. But, I mean, you can... You can do it, sorry, let me just bring it here. You can do it this to this or up, down here to up here. And that's what I'm going to be do. Down here to up here. Just like that. And fold it in half as best as you can. Now, the, the reason why this is ranked as a medium type of craft is because a lot of the folds are an exact and you might guess on some which is like completely fine and so yeah <laughs> sorry and what you're gonna do with this is now you're gonna bring this point and scissors to you're gonna bring both of them down a little over this uh this end so let me show you what i mean just like this something like this and then you would fold down but Try to get it to be equal on both sides. That's what I'm trying to do right now. Um, I think this is... You can pick it up if you want. That's what I usually do. And sorry if you can hear my fan. It's turned on right now. I'm in my room. And just like that. And crease it. Actually. And so this is what we have. And remember how I said that there's two, there's this one, and then there's this one here? You're going to go ahead and open it, this one up, like this, but fold it back in and try to bring it out just a little bit. Again, we are going to have to guesstimate on, on these sizes and stuff, but around this much. And fold it so it looks like there's a diamond. Just like this. If you can see, it looks like a diamond. Sorry if I was holding it too low and you couldn't see it. I didn't realize. Just like that. And I actually creased dot on it. This is how it looks like right now. And this is how the back looks right now. Just like that. And now I'm going to bring this point down here all the way up here. And I'm just gonna bring it like that. Try to be exact, but if not, it's okay. And just like that. You can see, like, obviously my folds aren't exact because I can't really exact that, but that's that's okay. And now I'll go ahead and turn it 180 degrees like this. And bring this flap up around here. And you can see that we have kind of like a diamond shape, but it's it's like a really bad diamond shape. Um, and then go and turn the whole piece around like this and bring it up as well. And try to um, make these two wings be the same, just like that. Okay. And now you can see that this is this is the bird, right? This is our wings. These are our wings. And this is the bottom. And um, if it bothers you, like this bottom, if it is imperfect, you can just cut it off. That's what I'm going to do after. And for the head, what you're going to do is open this up. And you're going to bring this top just a little down. Oops. Sorry if you can't see that. Like that. 
and then go ahead and open it up again and you're just gonna go like this and sorry if I'm being really so basically oops so what I did was I opened this up a little bit and I pushed down like this and then I'm gonna go ahead and close it crease on it just like that and mine my head is a little small on this one I know that I think the head is the hardest part because you can see on this one it's a little small oops sorry um even on the other side you can barely see it but that's okay but I did this before and I got a much bigger head as you can see in this one. It's a little too big. So experiment and see what you like. And here's some birdies. So I hope you liked today's lesson. It was much shorter, but like I said, um, the folds are more like um, inconsistent and they go on your type of basis. And we are done with the bird. Oops. And next week will be the butterfly. So look forward to that. And have a good day, everyone. See you next time.